gonna put my dog right away. Awesome. Well. That's weird. Oh, that's really fucking weird. Anyways, sorry, there was something going on VS. I was acting really funky. Anyways, welcome. Welcome, 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 welcome. Wait, welcome, welcome, welcome. So, if you didn't catch the end of last uh, yesterday's stream, we had gotten into another fortress. Crazy, I know. So, we found a new village, put another fortress there. Uh, there's another fortress like, not too far from there. Came back, and then last night I took the liberty of making a little alchemy stand here with infinite water here, you know, a bunch of cauldrons, and then, you know, got some water bottles here. But I went ahead and brewed up some eight minute strength potions, a few more uh, fire resistance potions thanks to the magma cube that we slain. And then I just got the water breathing potions here, just to keep everything kind of organized. Got our nether wards planted down. Cocoa beans, like I said, I'm not going to do too much with cocoa beans, but they're here. And yeah. Got them all situated. So, today, we're going to be making a trip to the understructure. So I'm gonna go grab a couple obsidian. Okay, maybe a couple more obsidian. I hope I have enough obsidian for this. We're gonna grab the ender pearls too, because we're gonna need them. I probably will not activate it right away. I'll probably put it in a chest, and then uh, we'll save the activation and everything for a, uh, a future stream. Because I don't want to go into the end for the fight yet until I finish maxing out all this. Like, this only has Prot 2 on it. No, nothing there. That's alright. Prot 2, Prot 2. It's all Prot 2. I feel like I could do a lot better. Um, we can also increase our bows a little bit. Let's get some bows going. I'm just gonna throw a cauldron in between the things. I don't know. There's another. Oh, that's a flame bow. That might be useful. Looks like I'm gonna need to get some more obsidian. There's a power two bow. And there's our regular crossbow too. The mending fishing rod. Oh, so beautiful. So beautiful. So exotic. Maybe it's Maybelline. Alright, I just got back from doing my errands today, so I am honestly going to be like incredibly exhausted. Not that it's going to be obvious, but uh, yeah, I'm going to be incredibly exhausted today. I can tell you that already. Uh, we do need two more obsidian for the portal, and then I'm going to need to find some way of marking my way to the portal, so boop boop. That works. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, mm, I got a whole bunch of gold. I don't know how many I can do, but I'm thinking gold apples. I'm thinking gold apples. Okay, six. Six is a good number. That's not all the... Okay, never mind. We could do more. We could do more. Yeah, there we go. Seventeen. Seventeen's a nice, nice round number. Very much enjoy that number. Alright. Get blaze powders. Eyes. We'll, we'll stay with the sixteen eyes for now. And we'll, we'll go from there. Uh, uh la, 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 la. let's bring a water breathing potion in case it's underwater. Uh fire resist doesn't really hurt in case we run into something that's not helpful. And then a strength potion just for shits and gigs. Might as well. 
Doesn't hurt us to be ready for anything. Can I? How does one repair shield? With wood. Nice. I was hoping it was going to be wood and not iron. Not that I don't have enough iron, thankfully, from uh, yesterday's uh, excitement. Oh, I should bring a bucket with water. That would be very helpful. Uh, I'm going to leave the diamond axe behind. I don't think I'm going to need it. You know what? No. Don't leave it behind. Let's take it. Let's fucking take it. Better safe than sorry. I might switch from coastal armor to rib armor trim to see what it looks like. I'm kind of curious. But yeah, we're going to work on getting a bow together for the dragon fight. And then uh, a couple other things we want to get situated. Let's go ahead and use the one that's already used. I like that better. Uh, once we start this, I'm not gonna stop until we find the place. So, let's go and make another boat. In case. Uh, I got cobblestone for, for guiding lights. One inside the nether, because I'm gonna take the nether back. So, that'll be our option there. Just make a, 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 a whole slew of pink petals. That's how I find my way back, is just pink petals everywhere. You know, that's funny. It's funny to think about that, but maybe. With any luck, we'll find it, like, almost immediately. You don't have to worry about shit. But, uh... I'm not going to bank on it. My luck is usually not that good. Alright. Anything else I need? I think we're good. That direction. Nice. Alright. And we're off. Um, hang on. Uh, da -da 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 -da. You know, I just realized, I was looking up journey music, and then I realized I don't have YouTube Premium, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna get an ad in the middle of me journeying, and that won't be great. So, we'll not do that. But I did want to. I did want to add journeying music. We got music on, so it's just, they're not playing the passive Minecraft <gasps> music stuff. I mean, fuck. Oh, manly voice. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay. Cool. So it's probably going to be this way for a very long time. My luck. Look at that boo. Look at that, that bee with the honey butt. Are you another one? Yeah, you another one. Got tons of honey. You do it, B. You do it. You live your best B life. You best B leave it. really lucky 
practice so far. Free throws, no breaks. Next one is definitely going to break, though. I had a feeling it might bring me out into the water, so uh, I'll switch fire res potion after the boat. I feel like more times than not, it's usually either under a, a mountain of some sort or it's in an ocean. One of the two. Sorry. That itch my nose and I bump my bump my mouse. Alright. Wow. Okay. Wow. You know, that's the sound I need. I need the Professor Oak wow from the original Pokemon Snap. Wow. <laughs> that sound clip alone. When you strip your girl when you strip for your girl for the first time. Wow. <laughs> uh not me ever. Anyways. Uh I wonder how far this is gonna be. I mean I'm willing to go the distance. So Define where I belong. Okay. Yikes. Alright. That's fine, though. There is a lava pool right there. So it's this direction. I never did get Light Matica. Uh, not Light Matica, but uh, Fulbright. I've been watching like a lot of those, like, uh... 10 second uh, Minecraft builds on TikTok and whatnot. And they, they got some crazy shit, man. They got some crazy fucking builds, bro. Are you fucking serious? It was this close the entire time. A dark, a dark forest biome was this close the entire time. I'm just gonna do that. Hang on. I, I just want to see if there's any stalagmites, too. Man, I went far out to get this shit, and it's like, back door. At my back door. Like, what the hell? That being said, there's probably going to be uh, an ancient city, because these are some pretty big fucking hills. Hey, look how big this is. That screams ancient city. I didn't bring a fucking bed. Oh, I did dumb. I can outlive mobs. Very least, I gotta outrun them. I'm gonna get to a high point so I can throw this high. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, look, snow and ice. That way. That broke. Yikes. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Nice. I'm screenshotting that because that's a lush cave. It has clay and maybe axolotls in there. So that'd be really cool to have. Oh, there's gonna be packed snow here. And I came without boots. Got no leather boots for this, man. Man, look at that lush cave. Oh, that's so beautiful. 
I love lush caves. I love them. My problem is, it's well lit in there, so... Any mob spawns are going to be, like, out here. <laughs> I should probably not dawdle too long. Well, that's a lava pit right here. If I ever seen the... If I ever seen one. Whee! We're at a decent elevation. You can kind of see for a good distance. It turned. No, it's under the snow. It's under the fucking snow. John Snow. So I probably was better off going in that lush cave, honestly. Oh my god, look at this craziness. Hang on. Before I get fucking jump scared and push into a ravine, hang on a second. Alright, so the skulk right there. There's lush cave everywhere. Oh my god, this place is huge. I could probably land in that water right there. It's gonna be a bitch for me to get back up, I'll tell you that much. My god, look at this place, guys! My goodness! This is nice. This is, you know what? This is definitely like build a base inside of this cave worthy, you know what I mean? light this shit up just start like forming it just build a mega base in here oh that'd be so nice I see got a lot of quartz like a lot of quartz being built here oh man please break oh it went all the way down. Alright. Time for me to follow. Whee! That was a lot of skeletons. With a lot of enchanted bows. Hello, sirs. Have you seen an eye? Have you seen an eye? Have you seen an eye? Aye, aye, aye. Oh, that's not good. There's shriekers down there. Really? That way? Fuck. Alright. Okay. I'll do it. I'll go this way. Oh no. I don't want to go this way. Uh, I don't want to go this way anymore. This way sucks. This way really, really sucks. Yeah, yeah. What are you gonna do? You gonna go in the boat? Yeah. Go Alright. I'm not liking this place. This place sucks. A lot.
they go up? Yeah, it went up. That's either above me or below me. Can't be above me, right? I need to make backup plans here. In case I fuck up. I, I hate finding strongholds. And I'm not very seasoned with it either, obviously, so. I imagine this place has to be massive, right? Usually there's two libraries and a whole bunch of other bullshit in it. It just meant that direction. Like back this way. I don't know. Back over here. Just really high up. Make Gamlet just block that up so I don't worry about anything coming up behind me. Where are the eye vendor? Okay. That's not helpful for my survivability. But, we'll have to make it work. Where the eye? The eye dropped over here. Didn't it? Did I grab it? Like, I, I would think I would see it protruding from somewhere if it's below me. But I'm not seeing anything up either that's a clear indicator either so I hope this place is fucking massive okay I think that one broke it's going back this way Man, do I have to? Do I have to? I don't like this. Bitch. I'll fuck you up. Alright. Throw it. Where's it at? Alright, I'm just gonna dig down from here. Uh. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, I found it. Oh, I found it. I'm not happy that I found it. This is very bad. Very, very bad. This is very bad. Oh, man. Why? 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 Very bad. Very, very bad. Okay. There's a giant fucking hole in the middle of the goddamn stronghold. That's cool. Love all that. Huh, that's very helpful. What a lovely chest. Oh boy. I got a bad feeling about this place. Like, it's not gonna be a completable portal. Something like that. It's, it's gonna be something. Oh boy. Alright. God. Why? Why? Why is it full of skulk? Can we not? Do I not have to fight the warden to get to the fucking ender dragon? Oh, of course there's another one there. Of course there's another fucking thing there. Just break the fucker. Just break it. where I came from. Of course. armor trim. I don't know if that's rare or not, but... I'm not gonna worry about it right now. Prop 3, knock back 2, an empty map. That could technically be useful. Okay, so that's the only chest downstairs. Oh, there it is. All right. I need 10. 
I got exactly 10. Now remember what I said. We ain't gonna go in today. So, this last one, we'll put the last eye right there. What we gonna do instead, seal this shit up. Bars. Only problem is I don't have water. You know it does have water. That out there. There's water right there, in fact. Is that the easiest water? No. Fucking hell. All the zombies. Mm. Oh my god. Oh, you dropped the shovel. Nice. <laughs> Thank you. I'll take your water. Oh. There we go. Alright. We got water. So now we can just do this. And then just grab that. And grab that. Alright, now the fun part. For the sake of uh, posterity, 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 prostate cancer, whatever. Um, go ahead and mark that up. Go ahead and grab that gone. Alright. So we're good. We don't, we don't even need any more eyes. So the blaze powder is extra. The ender pearls are extra for the fight. That's cool. So, you know, uh, yeah, we're fine. Bring the enderpearls with us. Just be safe. Soul Sand Valley. Nice. Oh boy. Somebody come get her. She's dancing like a stripper. Alright. Here's the only problem. I don't know how to make my way back from up here. Um, I can take a guess on what direction to go. But, uh... Honestly, it's gonna be a pure guesstimation. And then I don't even have my gold boots either.
was gonna say I knew this place better, but I honestly don't. So this might be better if I just go back out to the overworld instead of getting lost in another. Um, I could also, I do have the coordinates for the previous nether. But it's gonna be, it's gonna be 5,000 blocks out from my main base. So I don't quite like that idea. So I don't think I want to do that. Uh. Other option is trying to go that direction, but I don't know. I think I'm gonna okay, we'll go out this way and then we'll make our way up, up and over. Somebody come get us! You dancing like us with us. Breakdancing? Um, that gives me a great way up. Wow, that's a lot of... It's a lot of fish. It's a lot of fish. No, why? Oh my god. Leave me alone! Thank you. Fucking hell. Alright, fishies. Alright. Get a breather. Let me get a breather. So I came in from right there. Okay, there's the there. Okay, yeah, that's my bridge. That's my bridge. Okay. So I dug in from there. So I know where that portal is. If I can get back out. There's an easy way out right there. Fuck. You know what I hate? I hate streaming this during the day because I don't have fucking Fulbright. And without Fulbright, it's hard for me to see because of fucking glare. I, I definitely need to get Fulbright. Just too much work to do right now. I think I have it for like a previous version, but it wouldn't do me any good now because... I'd have to roll back my Minecraft version to make it work. Uh. Alright. Head for the waters and then go a certain direction. Ow. Ow. 
Damn, skeleton. Calm down with your fucking aimbot. Bruh. <laughs> Dude's like in the CSGO, like, finals. Alright. I'll show you why that direction would be good. So we found the end, the the end stronghold, which is good, and we have all the up. Uh, hmm, we have all the eyes we need, which is also good. So we don't have much to worry about now. It's just preparation, which will be. I thought I heard a trident, so I kind of moved a little bit to the right. Uh, preparation going to be. Basically farm uh, that zombie spawner, try to get some enchant levels, and get our in gear all enchanted up. <sighs> it's going to be a long time off stream, so I'll probably do it off stream, just because it is going to be a lot of grinding. Uh, I do have the Protection 3 book, which does help, but it's not going to help too, too much, I don't imagine. Uh, if I can land here... <laughs> Bitch, I outrun you. Bitch, I outrun. Boop, boop, boop. You too slow for me, boy. I am speed. That's a lot of creepers. That's a lot of creepers. another lava pool when I don't need to go to the nether I find lava pool after lava pool figure that one out I guess I can call those checkpoints <laughs> okay so there's a village there I don't know if I know that village At least I don't remember if I know that village. If it has... Oh no, I've been here before. Yeah, I've been here before. Oh, where the fuck am I then? That puts me a lot further out than I thought it was. What's up, Kohei? Ooh, I'm gonna have to cross... Yeah, you know, I, I think I have to go across here. I think I'm a little too far east. At least what I want to say is east. I don't know. Could be south. I have a rough idea where I need to go. So, worst case scenario, I'll break out the screenshots and I'll find my uh, coordinates. I'm going to try to do it without. Just because I think I have a rough idea of where I am. And I'd rather confirm it. Without needing coordinates. Oh, goodness. I'm so happy. This is the furthest I've gotten in a hardcore series. Getting my end, my uh, blaze rods and my ender pearls. Having all the eyes I need for the, the end portal. And pretty much having the end fight like ready to go. It's just I want to get better in chance on my gear. And, uh, huh? I want to be more ready for, for that fight. Because I haven't done an Ender Dragon fight in a long time. So. I, w I want to do that. I want to be. I want to go in there properly ready. To, uh. To spank the big dragon in the sky. If I can beat a big lizard, then we're good. Well, I got bad news for me. Ow. Because I was breaking my ankles every two seconds, falling into holes. I don't recognize where I'm at. Uh, okay. What's my coordinates? So, we're looking at... That should be 300. That should be 500. So, this way, I think? 
I don't know. We'll find out. Yeah, wait, if I keep going this way, I'll, I'll eventually run into something I see and I, I might recognize. Hello, Matt. Welcome, welcome. I am currently lost trying to get back from the, from the end stronghold. Stop looking at me. Don't judge me for eating. Look. Don't judge me. Oh. Let me go pick up that meat then. I don't like to waste meat and leather. Mainly the meat, though. We don't. We don't waste that. Yeah. I wonder if I could bring my horse into the end dimension. I'm sure somebody's done that before. I feel like I know this river. Is it weird to say that I know a river? Probably. Probably weird. Yeah, this needs to go higher. I need to go this way for sure. But is it negative 500? I think it was positive 300, negative 500 is where my base is. Boy, I don't even need you no more. I get a 500 puts me back that way. I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna go back this way. Just because I don't know, and... Oh, I know that hole! I know that hole! I know that giant fucking hole! And I know that house! <laughs> okay! We found our base. We're back home. Alright. Get a sigh of relief. Da -da -da. Hello, kitty. How did things go while we were gone? Nothing happened? Yeah, I didn't think so. Another armor trim for the, for the stock here. I'm kind of curious what the eye one looks like. Alright, um... We can use water bucket. We can use... Water buckets and oak boats in there. Um, bows. Don't really need. We can cook those up. Uh, not gonna need flint and steel. We're definitely gonna need arrows for sure. Like a mass amount of arrows. Let's grab all our emeralds for trading. Those arrows. These arrows. I might have enough arrows to start a whole fucking revolution. <laughs> I'm ready. Okay, there's two empty maps. Some might be helpful for us later on. That's good. Let's get some more bows. Grab the cross crossbow too. More spectral arrows. We can always use those. Alright. We only have 20 levels, but look if we can run down here and uh, see if we can get on, on a bow or two. Uh. So right now we have flame, power two, and unbreaking one. Let's grab that unbreaking one, so that'd be unbreaking two. We can get find a power one. Ooh, that power two looks too nice. Honestly, I probably could have gone with the power one and been fine. 
There's a breaking two. So it's gonna make that's gonna be breaking three. That's good. There's another power one bow. Alright. Let's see if we can combine them. Alright, so we got power one unbreaking. Power one. Yep. And now I need another one of Neum. Which is fine, we got plenty of iron. <laughs> yo, yo, yo. We are doing good, actually. Just doing some final prep before Ender Dragon fight. Trying to get a bow together so we can uh, not totally suck. Okay, so the power two. Take that power two and I'm breaking. I need to go. Yikes. Okay. Which pace will we have? Oh my goodness. <sighs> Alright, so let's go to the zombie farm. I probably should do something with the zombie grinder, because I could definitely make it a little bit more, uh, a little bit more efficient, but, yeah, well. Many a moon ago, I found this zombie, uh, a zombie spawner down here. I almost died finding this one. And then I have a spider farm that I just haven't set up yet. But, zombie always works fine. Yeah, the guy that's in the canoe is kind of a, a big guy, too. But hey, you know, if it makes him feel, it makes him feel grounded. I mean, it's not a bad thing, I guess. Yeah, we got our little zombie spawner in here. I'll loot up the nearby cave so hopefully get this to uh, not take forever. And see, I've been here before. Just I haven't been down here recently. This is a really slow farm. <laughs> I thought about making maybe, uh, ooh, you know what I should have done? Ooh, do I have, I don't have wood. Do you have wood? No, you don't have wood. Yikes. I said if I had a crafting table, I could make another anvil. And just work on my bow down here. And that might speed things along. I guess what I could have done is I could have also traded the villagers inside the village there, underneath on my uh, in my basement. I could have traded them and got experience very quick and easy too. Hindsight, hindsight. I'm just so like me like right now. I'm so excited, you know. I'm so excited. We got the end portal. We know where it's at. It's only missing one eye. We have the eye in the chest right next to it. We have another portal that leads right to it. In a lush cave, nonetheless, which is. A humongous lush cave. So, we got a lot to look forward to. There's a lot to look forward to. Yeah, we'll sleep real quick. That way we can talk to the villagers. Alright. Uh, where's my librarian? You. What did you have? You have a looting 2 on you. I already got looting 3 on my sword. So I don't really need you per se. What I could use is a mending guy. I think I have another lectern here somewhere. Yeah, there's a lectern right there. Oh no! Why does the cat always sound like he's saying, oh no? Oh no! Meow! Meow! Alright. Give me a good trade. That's not a good trade. Hey, oh, oh. Alright, I don't even care if it's, the, if it's an expensive trade. Just give me a trade, bro. 
That's not the tr- That is not the droid I was looking for. Fire aspect one. Uh, not bad, but not what I want. You only got dog crap. What do you got? Nothing. You got nothing. Alright, we'll move this in the middle of the room. Uh, lucky to see three. No, thank you. Projectile protection. I need y'all to stop moving. You guys are not being very helpful right now. Who's touching it? You're touching it? 14 for eluding one. He likes. Come on now. Sharpness 2. Mm. Ah, it's tempting. It's tempting. Sharpness 2, I can I can work up to a 5 very very easily. Fire aspect 1 again. No thank you. Anyone else? Who's next? You're next. Knockback. You are wrong, sir. You are not helpful, sir. Infinity? If I didn't have a crap load of arrows, then maybe. But I have a crap load of arrows, so it's not going to be a, a, a pressing point for me right now. Power. That's not bad. That's not bad. So you got two into three. I can get one more power two. That'd be three, three, four. Then all I need is the one book. Uh. <laughs> I might regret that later. Curse of binding. What the fuck? This ain't a multiplayer server. Get the shit off my man. Hell no. Why? Why again? Depth Strider. Okay. Well, that ain't bad. If I, if I, if I was going for a, uh, a completionist, then I'd get a Depth Strider. Uh, Aqua Affinity's not bad either, but not what I want. Oh, come on. Feather. Ooh. Ooh. You dirty son of a bitch. I'm gonna have to get that. Considering I can get knocked up by the Ender Dragon, Feather Falling would be a really good idea. <sighs> I hate it when they're technically good. I hate it when they're technically good. Alright, let's grab that stuff. Can I make another lectern? I haven't made a lectern in a while. I forgot how to make it. If I should grab a bunch of random stuff, maybe it'll work. Here, I'll make a bookshelf. Does that help? Yeah. Slabs on a bookshelf. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a genius. Chisel bookshelf. Oh, wow. Oh, and they can store books in there. That's right. I've seen that on uh, a couple of different things. Oh, yeah. That, that's cool. That's cool. Uh, I can go drop off that blaze powder uh, in, the, in this room here. Because I don't need it for anything now. I've got my last eye already saved. So I'll never need blaze powder again except for uh, alchemy. Which is really weird to say that. But Alright, let's go find the other guy. Let's lock in his trade. Not you. Yes, you. Give me feather falling. Thank you very much. Good business. Good business. Now, who else? You? Blast protection. That's a no. Riptide. That's still a no. That's a no. That ain't... You ain't... Oh my god. Respiration. That's a no.
That's definitely no, because that's nothing. Blast protection. That's a no. Oh my god, please move. Infinity. I'm going to be really regretful for that later on, but right now I don't need it. Looting three. Okay, all right. That's a no. Impaling three. I'll take unbreaking. I'll take mending. Punch does not help. Punching the dragon does not help at all. You're not helpful either. Oh my goodness, I hate this part. I hate this part of trying to find a... a ooh. Oh, it's technically it's good. It's technically good. <laughs> oh, that breaks my heart. It, break, it breaks my heart. Oh, it's gonna, it's gonna be a beast to try to find that one again. Why infinity? Why so much infinity? I'm not trying to go to infinity and beyond. Loyalty three. I don't even have a trident. Why? I don't even have a trident. Come on now. Stop looking at me like that. Look at me like you want to punch me. And I can't take your punches. Your punches hurt. Another infinity mother. This game really loves its infinity. There's, why? What's with all the chan what's with all the trident ones? Riptide, trident, frickin' fire aspect again. I should have. I honestly should have kept the efficiency and made a new lectern. But I'm dumb. And yeah. Why? Why infinity again? <laughs> I don't want infinity. I don't want infinity. I should have kept the efficiency, honestly. I, I I will regret that. I will s looting one. I will certainly regret that. All right, now I'm thinking about end game. I'm not thinking about post game. So, God. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Oh man. Okay. It would do a little bit of damage to the dragon when it hits me. <sighs> nah. Keep going. Keep rolling. I'm gonna run out of villagers soon, and then I have to make more beds, and no, I don't want to do that crap. Projectile protection. No. I see 45 and I'm thinking, please be mending. I see 45 and, it just, and I'm, I'm just praying that it's mending and it's Bane of Arthropods. Like... Frostwalker. Move. Frickin' Frostwalker. At least it's something different. Anyone? Trash. They're all going to bed. Alright. Yeah, the efficiency four. If I'm thinking post game, I should have kept it, but like right now I really want to get uh I really want to get unbreaking or mending. One of those two. Those are my two like main targets right now. get netherite because there's really no point to it all netherite does is make my armor not burn there's no big difference except for knockback resistance 
And I really wouldn't need that anyways. Luck at the C1. Netherite at this point would be a waste of time for me. So. Uh, come on, guys. Curse of Vanishing. Really? Curse of Vanishing, if you die, your armor disappears. But, like, there's no... Oh, why punch two? I, I, I saw you burn and turn and burn. Thought he was going for it. Yeah, I mean, a regular sword w would be fine. I don't know, unless they changed it some... That was sneaky. That was sneaky. I didn't even see the dude touch the lectern. Alright. But from my understanding is that netherite uh, armor, at the very least, wouldn't be worth it. Okay. That's... Arguably helpful, but arguably not. That's definitely not helpful. That's very not helpful. Okay, I didn't think you could be any less helpful, honestly. Let me on. Okay. Why is it getting worse? It's getting progressively worse as we go along. I'm gonna hit one of these villagers. That iron golem can come over here and body check me, and it's gonna be over. This is how I die. Knock back two. Don't need it. That's the feather falling guy. Okay, there, there's a guy. Looting. T oh God, get out of my way! God, man, one to the left, one to the right, one down the middle. I'm gonna hit someone. I'm gonna hit someone. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Only 20 for the mending. I know it could be less. I know it could be less, but you know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take the mending. I'll take it. I'll take it all day long. Oh, I can start putting some mending on this stuff. Oh, goodness gracious. All right. I need. How about this? I'm, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. We're gonna get a double chest. Put it right there. And we're just gonna put all the fun stuff in there. Uh, the boat we don't need for now. We'll put that stuff away. Don't need the golden apple for now. All right. So now what I need to do is I need to get some more emeralds and do some trading. Because one, I need experience. Two, I need emeralds. Because I could definitely use them. So we're going to put those away. Books. Lapis. Emerald. What I could do, I could take some goodies here. Make those into a thing. Oh, it's raining outside. Nice. Let me take the diamond sword from here. I'm not using that. One of those bamboo planks. Alright. Crap load of sticks. Oh, yeah. Crap load of sticks. I'm so used to playing on high pixel, so like I'm used to doing like the rogue sword run, like the run and burn here. And uh, yeah, it feels weird. Oh, I can get my spider stuff uh, situated. Oh, and I can get chickens too, cause that's that's feathers for that. That's smart. Oh, I gotta, I gotta get that going. Cause I can get I can make chickens into like an auto kill system. And then that'd work out so beautifully. Alright. So I might have a couple bits of bamboo here. That's why I did this. I 
when the auto crafter comes along, this is gonna be so beautiful. What we need? Okay, so if they are serious about adding an auto crafter to the game, they should add an auto trader, to where you can have it to where it'll trade automatically. Like you can do it with a, uh, you can do it with pigmen right now, where you can just drop gold into a chamber, and then they'll pick it up and do it themselves. But there's no way to auto trade with villagers. And I think that's a, uh, a missed opportunity. I think we could definitely uh, see improvements if we implemented that. Like, can you imagine, like, long, long play, oops. Imagine long play series where you, you can just have auto crafters, auto traders. Yeah, I've been watching a lot of Hermitcraft on, in my free time, and... Watching what the auto uh, crafters hooked up to like an iron golem farm or hooked up to Like any any real farm really like it, it's been crazy watching that stuff Because it literally takes the drops makes it from iron into blocks then blocks into whatever it was going to make um, Which farms gonna be incredibly powerful because of uh, the redstone and the, and the gunpowder which which farms gonna be huge, 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 huge? Uh, skeleton farms can be can be automated into bone blocks for ex for easier storage. Like there's so much you can do with with auto crafter like that. Go ahead, upgrade. All right, and you also have string. So yeah, um, post game definitely have to work on that spider grinder. So I got a I got a spider spawner. I just gotta work on getting it situated. Yeah, well, gold farms are already kind of crazy. They're already kind of crazy, but I mean, power one quick charge. Ooh, that's not bad. That's not bad. Have you touched your thing? No, you didn't touch your thing. Yeah, one emerald for a bow. That's kind of funny. Alright, um... So we got extra sticks for the time being, which kind of sucks, but... It is what it is. We definitely want to put mending on this bow here. Um, that's some breaking three. That's power, power, flame. We're not going to go with infinity, so that's fine. So, that bow is extra. I guess see if I can get a power three bow. Or something of that sort. I'm breaking, I'm breaking, I'm breaking. Yeah, yeah. Alright, I'll just combine what I have. I don't need a power five bow, but I mean... Something as close to it as possible is going to be amazing. That's a 7, huh? That's an 11. Alright, well, I got power 2 mending. I can go 15 that way, or 19 that way. So, I'll probably put flame on that for the 7. And then go from there. So, we'll, we'll drop off these two. We ain't gonna need them. Oh, this has been a roller coaster. I failed my last hardcore series because of a ghast. And this one has gotten pretty far. I'm pretty happy with this. This is all new to me. I usually fail by the time I get blaze rods. Like, either right after or, like, getting out of the nether, I, I get killed or something happens. So, this has been a really nice uh, change of pace. Hi, buddy. How's it going? You want to talk about it? Yeah, okay. This has, been a, this has been a real nice change of pace. Let's see. Uh, I did say I wanted to have a crafting table by the zombie. Where's the iron? Then I can make another anvil. And I can put that next to the zombies too. Yeah, brutes. See, that's the thing. I didn't see any brutes when I went to the Bastion. 
I went to the Bastion, there was no Brutes. And it was like, okay, well, I'm not going to play around anymore. And, uh... I grabbed the gold that I saw, and I and I, I dipped. And that's when I found the Nether Fortress, is right after I, I got the gold from the Bastion. Which is really crazy. I even got Ponder. <laughs> yeah! You know what? We bring it out. We we bring it out. I don't care. That's coming with us at a dragon fight. We bring it out to the dragon fight. Oh. Yeah. So I I I AFK'd overnight one night. I woke up to this was used to be wood roof. I had to change it out because part of it burned. I had a cat outside here that got struck by lightning. It was just like a giant, like, anything that could go wrong, went wrong. <laughs> I was like, okay, well, I've never had a cat struck by lightning before, but first time for everything, I guess. <laughs> so, <laughs> it was just crazy, like, that was when I first got my sugarcane farm and everything. I, I went AFK, and I did it inside of a little dirt hut. I woke up, half of my dirt hut's gone, and the freaking Enderman is holding the dirt block that I just placed back down, because I was going to go to the bathroom before I started streaming. He just put, he took the dirt block and moved it out as soon as I placed it. I was like, where did that dirt block go? <laughs> I didn't know it was the Enderman until I undid the rest of the dirt. I was like, oh my goodness. And it's just dirt like a couple blocks away from my character where he's like scattered it. <laughs> it's just, I had so such a weird time on this profile. I mean, I, I, I love I love it. I love it. it. It's just funny how weird things can be sometimes. Alright, let's drop this down. Drop that down. Come on, Zentrines. Oh, I, I've had a hell of a time with this profile. I mean, I found the zombie spawner here. There's a spider spawner I found that's not too far away from the main base. It's inside the tunnels. So, I mean, I can't say I'm that unlucky. The most unlucky thing so far was trying to find another fortress. That took forever. Like, forever, forever. Because I was going, like, thousands of blocks each way in the nether. I couldn't find it. Hello, kitty. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I haven't seen a brute, which is really odd. I've seen two bastions and no brutes. I almost got killed by a, a, a hoglin on a freaking. Uh, I was towering up right next to the bastion, and a hoglin just smacked me off a pillar twice. That would have been embarrassing. That would have been real embarrassing. But uh, I've been pretty lucky. I've been pretty lucky overall. It's also because uh, instead of trying to like speed run it, like I'm just trying to like survive, and I'm not trying to like I'm not trying to run through this as fast as possible. I'm taking my time, you know, enjoying the enjoying the journey for once. Yes, I will eventually fight the Wither. But it'll be after. Uh, it'll be after I fight Ender Dragon. Wither's gonna be an end game boss. Uh, same thing for the Warden. I will fight the Warden at some point. I don't know when. Because I spent a lot of time between here and Hypixel. So, I play on my hardcore personal world. And then I play on Hypixel Skyblock. So. I was feeling a little bit spicy today. So, I came onto the hardcore world. And I was able to find the end, the end structure already. So, I have all the eyes ready. For the for the ender end dragon fight, that's all situated. I've been making backups. I've been making backs up backups, so I'm fine. So I wouldn't have anything to worry about really. That and I have you know the streaming catalog too. So if I need uh, I always use I always save these streams as vods. So if I need coordinates or something, I can easily just go back and look at the coordinates 
I usually take screenshots of all the important things like nether portal locations, uh, where villages are at, special biomes I've been looking for. So. The only thing I am missing is dripstone. I love dripstone, okay? Dripstone is my new my newest favorite block since the caves and cliffs because of the fact that you can make infinite lava. Infinite lava gets rid of the need for doing any coal farming or anything like that. It's really nice. I have not found any dripstone at all. In the thousands of blocks I've traveled, I have checked every little cave. And yeah. Yeah, so like my big plan right, as of right now is is go fight Ender Dragon, then go get Elytra, get the Elytra enchanted. I got I got a mending guy. I got a mending villager. We're good. Um, get Elytra enchanted, get rockets, and go and go for it. I might have to make a creeper farm. Which, ever since I've tamed one cat, there's been like a thousand cats outside my main base. So, a creeper farm is very possible. I do need to do my iron farm at some point. But I got so lucky with caving that I didn't need iron all of a sudden. So, yes, I love shulkers. I freaking love shulkers, dude. Like, so one of the things I did is I used to play on a... A Minecraft server a while like a long while ago and what I did before I quit the server is I took all my items put them into shulker boxes and then put all my shulker boxes into the player ender chest so if I ever decide to go back on that server for any reason like you know I get bored and I just want to go back I can access all my old items in my ender chest of the shulkers yeah I don't think that would do any any good like positive things because the Endermen don't really care about cats. I think they they they'd more more likely die to either Ender Dragon or falling off the falling off the edge for some reason. But uh, I was thinking maybe take the cats and use them for the creeper farm because you can make the cat the cats will scare the creepers into falling down the holes. And then you can have them all into a little area. That'd make a gunpowder farm for not just end crystals for other dragon fights, but it'd also give me a uh, a firework rocket farm. That way I can use it for uh, for the elytras. So a lot of stuff I want to do is like post game. It's what I call post game at least. It's after I beat the ender dragon. Hardcore is done. I got the main progression done. Then the rest of it is just getting automation up, getting some stuff that's, you know, that's quality of life. And then going from there. Like, typically, I wouldn't be streaming this part. I, I would be sitting here for... I would let it sit up for a while. And, uh... You know, I'd, I'd be playing, like, a movie or something on the side. Let this run. Have, like, a hundred zombies here at some point, And then just slice them all down. Um, this, is, this is hella slow. What day am I on now? Let's see. Day 168. Mind you, that's a lot of AFK time, too. Because I AFK'd my sugar cane and my uh, bamboo farm overnight a couple times. So, that and I've been sleeping in my bed a lot too, especially early on. I just I don't I don't do night times early on. Like the first two weeks of me being on here was just every time the sun got close to it, it is like okay, where's my bed? Where's my bed? I don't want to play with creepers. I don't want to play with skeletons. Let me get some armor first. Let me get a shield, and then we'll get a little braver. But right now, nope. That should be more than enough time for the stick trades to refresh, hopefully. They should have been able to uh, do their thing. I haven't finished my barn yet, which is really sad. I was doing barn because I needed... Oh, I never finished that corner either. 
I was doing a barn because I needed more uh, leather. My god, the sheep have eaten the grass out of this place. You guys are horrible. But yeah, I wanted to get a lot of cows for leather. I got my chickens for eggs, obviously. Which I'm gonna end up probably making this into an automated uh, farm. Where I'll have the chickens, uh, the eggs spit out, go into a bubble elevator, come back around and be auto dispensed. And I'll put a bunch of observers on it just to have it situated. Um, that or I could put it on a redstone clock system. I usually throw a redstone clock system with double observers uh, on multiplayer servers just so there's no lag or any like excess lag. But yeah. I can do a fully automated since I'm by myself. Sorry about to be nighttime again. Oh wait, no. Use the bad sword. Use the unenchanted sword, because this this messes your sword up real quick. But bamboo, it's, it's faster to beat it with a sword than to use a hatchet on it, which makes no sense, because you'd think it's an organic, which means you'd usually use like a hatchet, like an axe, I mean. But, uh... Nope. Sword is apparently faster. Hello, random dirt block that an Enderman left. Looking for iron right now? Yeah, honestly. For the longest time, I had trouble with keeping iron. Especially early game, keeping iron is rough. Especially when you're trying to make like hoppers and you know mine carts. Like I have a whole mine cart hopper system down there that I probably could be a little bit more economically friendly with. But uh, I kind of threw caution to win and just said whatever and put a whole row of, of highs. You are not cool. Not cool. You made me break my bamboo. How dare you, you? Okay, are we good? We good? Okay. Um, make some sticks here real quick. Yeah, auto crafters would be so helpful. Cause then I, I wouldn't have to go through all this. I can just like close these boxes off, make the sticks right there, then they, it'll know, hey, it's time to make uh, the sticks. Little buddy. Little buddy. I figure probably gonna do this for a little while longer and then we'll probably switch over to high pixel. I have to go check on my minions. I'm high pixel there and uh get those situated. Oh, these guys are sleeping now. They're not gonna be too helpful. R really? 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 Haha. Haha. -ha. <laughs> He walked far enough away so I could sleep in the left bed, but not the right bed. That's kind of funny. Alright. Oh, you're gonna only do 30 ones. Oh, you suck. Oh, and there's an Enderman. Hi, friend. I hear you like sticks. If you want, I can trade you a bunch of sticks. Uh-huh. Damn. <laughs> I've already traded them out. I mean, it works for me. Uh, I think one of the biggest things I'm going to do is right after... Uh, right after I do uh, the Ender, Ender Dragon fight, I might try to make an Ender Enderman farm. Just for faster uh, EXP gains. Click space, it automatically fills the sticks. I might have to. I'll, I'll try that. 
whenever uh, I have the option. I gotta wait for these guys to not get bullied into the corners and go touch their things. They need to go restock. Go restock! Jesus. Yeah, I didn't know it. that's what it did, so... Oh. No. They're gonna take a while, aren't they? Alright. I mean, we got emeralds for now. I'm trying to think of any other way I can get experience. Because my zombie farm's not doing too hot. Hi, buddy. What you doing? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah. You being a good little keeper of the house. I heard that. Oh, dude, that is so fucking great. I never knew that. Dude, Duckling, you rock. Today, you have taught me something new. And I appreciate that. Wow, that is so fucking cool. I've been playing this game for years, and I've never done that. <laughs> that just tells you how crazy it's been. Oh, my goodness. Alright, we got a little bit of spider with spider string here. Let's go try to get that. If I can get this bow at least kind of situated, I'll be happy. That's our feather falling dude. Uh, does that put you over? Yeah, it does. What do you got? Power one. And you're also a chicken lover. Okay. Alright. And now you're a master, and you have quick charge. Alright. So, chicken farm. Uh, chicken squash farm, I should say. That's something I should probably do. There's the... I can make the automatic chicken farm. Where there's the, the lava there. And wherever the chicken grows up, he touches the lava and dies. I'd have cooked food then. I can also put it on a hopper sorting system. To where it'll send the feathers this way. I wonder how like crazy I want to get with it though. how crazy I want to get with it. Whee. So yeah, so I, I came down here or like a long time ago. Like a stream or two ago when I was doing this. And I, I was just trying to find Donald. <laughs> Woo, that scared the crap out of me. That was a late, uh, <laughs> a late thing. The event list, uh, up updated before that. That's weird. But thanks, Dub. Uh, thanks, Dub. Uh, yeah. Tongue tied? I get tongue tied. Thank you, Duckling, for subscribing. But, uh, I came down here. We were doing some diamond farming to get our diamonds situated. Oh, the clusters are ready. So, yeah, I have an amethyst cluster here, which I'll eventually play with. And then I kept digging, kept digging. And then at some point, I just heard a lot of spiders. Like, a great amount of spiders. And then all of a sudden, boop! I found this little beautiful, beautiful little thing. So, <laughs> I have string... I just gotta do something with this, so I'll have to make this into a, a, a farm and make that into its own thing. There's a whole cave system in here. I've done a full exploration of the cave uh, the cave here, which I think I did. So there's not really not much more to find in here. But yeah, I have a spider spawner and a zombie spawner. Not too far away from each other, really. This one's just really far down. And it, it was just weird to be able to hear it that close, you know what I mean? Because you know there's something going on. When you hear, like, a lot of skeletons or a lot of zombies or a lot of something, you know there's probably a spawner there or, like, a really big cave or something. Yeah, I got lucky. 
I got lucky that there was a, a spider spawner. Yes. I, I really need to work on speed potions. But yeah, any real building, like any like mega bases or anything, I probably won't do until after uh, the Ender Dragon. Just because I want to have Ender Dragon down, and then I can start working on getting like the beacon situated, because I can start fighting the Wither in the end area underneath the uh, <laughs> underneath the uh, the little pool there, just so he can't break any blocks and hurt anything. So I'll probably fight the Wither there. I did see. Uh, on a Hermitcraft video from Ren Dog, that you can have a bunch of chickens put down before you summon the Wither, and when you summon the Wither, it'll kill all the chickens and give you a huge batch of Wither roses, like one rose per chicken. So it, that'd be really good for like automated farms, like the zombie automate automated farms to get the the rotten flesh, you know, and a bunch of other things that we could be doing. So, I have tons of little ideas that I want to, uh, that I want to borrow from other series that I've been watching. And we're definitely going to be taking advantage of that eventually. It's just like, a, this is a slow, casual play. I'm not going to go crazy. I'm not going to try to, like, do 20 things at once. I'm not going to grab that bed. Yeah. We can put that bed right there. Have a kid for me. This is like a casual... Like, I try to set goals for every stream that I do, so... My goal today was get to the end the, the end structure, get the portal room found, and get back to base. And I've done that already. So now I'm literally in the mode of, let's get all this stuff here. You know, prop for unbreaking, all that stuff. Yeah, so someone probably put a wither, uh, a wither inside of it. I got kelp for a bubble vader that I was gonna make eventually. I can also do a kelp farm for experience too. I don't know how good kelp farms are for experience, but I know that is a possibility. I assume they're decent because I've seen it on a. Uh, on a few different multiplayer servers where they have a kelp farm. So it might be something I look forward to. Oh, I got paper and gunpowder right there. I can make rockets. <laughs> Honestly, when I go end busting, if we get to the point where we can end bust, I'm bringing rockets with me. So as soon as I get the elytra, it's done. I I'm going to be flying away. <laughs> but I do plan on having tons of gunpowder hopefully by then so we can have tons of rockets huh. honestly as it stands I'm pretty much at a stopping point for this for now just cuz it's from this side it looked like half of those weren't even there it's kinda weird I'm at a weird stopping place for now. So, I'll probably go check Hypixel real quick. Go check on my minions there. And then we'll see how that goes from there. I got one, two beds, three beds available. So, yeah, I'll work on giving them some bread and getting them situated. I eventually want to have a villager trading hall. I want to do mega base. Like a, 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 once, a one shot big mega base. I want to do tons of automation, but I don't want to do it until post-game. Just because if I die, then it's more of a regret if I do it early. Having full automation before going into End Ender Dragon, it just feels bad, man. Because it's like, oh, well, I did all that work for what? So, once I know I can get Ender Dragon down, I can get Elytra, then I don't feel so bad about, you know, starting to invest time into getting... Mega farm situated. But let's go check Hypixel real quick. That 
was loud. Alright. Nice. 77,000 coins as interest while I was gone. Let's go ahead and grab all the stuff in the minions. So we hoping I would get uh, an upgrade there. Emeralds. We're trying to get the banking, uh, personalized banking unlocked, so the emeralds are going to be huge for getting that situated. You need 24 to upgrade. I have 17. Yikes. Okay. I put diamond spreading on this guy. Who's not doing that well with diamonds. It's kind of sad. But yeah, I need refined diamonds for a couple projects in uh, the Dwarven Forge. So, I'll work on that later. For now, I'm going to leave it sit like this. He's doing fine. He's not full. And it keeps me from having to keep checking stuff. I need to put the super compactor things on this guy. That's situated. Yeah, so what I did is I fully situated my skyblock with like a whole bunch of grass, and then I started building my storage system areas here. Um, if you have your your YouTube uh, subscriptions has hidden on your profile, it might uh, it might not play sounds because it might not let anyone be aware that you subscribed. YouTube's been like that for a, a long time, where if you have your stuff, uh, per, like, privated, it won't do it on any streamer's, uh, thing. But I do appreciate you, Zezu. Appreciate it very much. Eh, four hours. Okay, I got four hours on that. I haven't done much for Garden. I do have Unstable Dragon Armor. I have Necrotic Helmet. And then everything else is wise. My garden's not too great. Yikes. Eight pests. I try. I try. I got melon farm here. I got carrots over here. I was going to work on getting a couple more, but I... The way I want to do it is I want to get a line of five so I can have, like, the mega, you know, just run through and just do everything at once. like, And then either have drops at the end or teleports it's like in Polish and you're ready to speak in Polish nice well I did do my kielbasa recently you know it's very nice what are you guys doing here what do you want sugar oh turbo mushrooms interesting cactus green potato Hey bail times eight for a ticket. Cactus green. I hate cactus, bro. Cactus is so bad. Like it's one of the worst crops you could you could put on a garden. Like honestly, it's so bad. Ugh. Ever grilled it? No, I. I always like fry it or I'll I'll do like a, a bake. Like I'll bake it with like potatoes or something. I've never grilled it. Hello, crazy. Yeah, so I can either go this way or I can go that way. Which is 64. 64, and then... Actually, these prices change whenever I start doing stuff, so yeah. That's not going to matter much. Oh, holy crap. That's a lot. So, composts... Ever since the pest update, I don't like coming to the garden anymore. Because I don't like dealing with the pests. Like, the pests give you the enchanted goods. Like, don't get me wrong. They make it worth it. But I just don't like doing garden anymore because of it. Because every time I'm in the middle of dealing with something, a new pest has spawned in plot three. Really? Like, 
That's one of the few things that I, I just don't like. They need to set it to where you can, uh, we can just say no. Because that, that'd be cool. If you'd be like, nah, I don't feel like dealing with pests. Turn them off, you know, permanently set them off. There's a way that you can block pests, but you can only block them, like, at an hour at a time right now. Unless there's something further on that I don't know. Try to cut very little and not too deep lines in the kibasa and grill it. Mine's said the fat can drum into the coal and cook better. Oh. Yeah, I'm going to try that next month here. Because, uh, I don't have any kibasa. But, yeah, I'll... T I've been thinking, dude. I've had... I haven't had any, like... Any, like, pork or anything in a while. And it's like... I've been... I've been wanting some, like... Some good grilling meats, you know what I mean? Like, I'm going to... That ain't bad. That's, that's a really good idea. Uh, what's everyone playing on, Chase? I am playing on Hypixel.net. I'm playing on Skyblock. Which reminds me, let's go check our other profile. I have one, I have my main profile, and this is my secondary profile. My secondary profile is here just so I can level up these slime minions, which will eventually make me passive money for my main profile. But unfortunately, I'm still in the setup phase for this, so... Yay. <laughs> I got music today. Okay, I need a stack for tier 6 to... Uh, to go from 6 to 7. These guys are tier 6. So, oh, he's 7. Okay, you're the last 6. Okay, and then we'll go from the right here, so we'll make you an 8, and then I need 90 more, so that's 128, so two stacks for one upgrade. Yikes. Alright. So the auto crafting is done through the personal compactor that I'm playing with. This one only has one slot for being the 4000, because it's a base model, but the... The more expensive it is, like the the rare, the epic, the legendary, the more things can be auto crafted. So, Ooh. I need to go check. Yeah, I need to go check this. Ooh, under chest in two hours. Hey, minion slot, nice. All right. That's seven days. Okay, so I got a week until that one's ready. Which is kind of rough. I'm not gonna lie. But it's fine. Wow! I got Slimey Bobby. Oh, Zazu, thank you. Thank you for subscribing. I appreciate you. But now what we can do is add a compactor and that. You made it public. Okay, yep, that'll, that'll do it. I don't like this. This is going to be all kinds of pain. Hi. How's it going, little one? How you doing? Yeah, you got out of your cage. Sorry, buddy. Alright. Put the compactor in them. And then we got that situated. So, I'm doing what I usually do in vanilla Minecraft. You got carpets for anti-spawning rules. Spawning only goes out to eight blocks, including what they're like where they're at there. So, technically the spawning stops right here, but I put an extra one just to be safe. And then of course, they don't spawn in on air blocks. They don't spawn out here either cuz it goes up to the four rule. So, all slimes are going to spawn inside this little cage. These guys are going to attack the slimes. I need seven more enchanted slime balls, so yep, yeah, okay. One stack. Yeah, it's it's a really nice little setup. I, I uh I did not make that setup. It was borrowed from a YouTuber, I forgot their name, which makes me feel really bad now. But that's my passive money farm for the time being on my secondary profile. I got a couple friends who play on Hypixel here. And what I'll usually do is, uh, 
if I need something transferred or, or, or there's something that needs to be done, I'll talk to them and they can talk to me and be like, hey, if you need something transferred, hit, let me know. I'll help you transfer one thing from one to another and vice versa. So we don't have the enchanted hoppers on them yet, which is how they automatically sell things. So it's not going to be anything to worry about anytime soon. But when that gets going, that slime farm, oh my god, it's going to be good. You're going to be looking at probably 4 million a day, just passive income. So it's going to be really nice. I do want to redo the flooring here. So this is my, my pretty much my catch-all for everything else. So I have some, like my combat potions, my foraging, farming, and my mining stuff here. So I'm going to end up doing a, a special thing here. I plan on doing specialized roofing. Like, I want to do a giant spiral here with both uh, purple and pink. So, I have, I have a lot of ideas I want to do with this. But right now, I'm just trying to get like the bare bone structure situated. I do have to do a little bit of fixing. Because when I was making this, I made a little too... I made a little bit of an oopsie here. You can see that uh, it's not quite right. <laughs> not quite right. What's up, Hello Boy? I haven't really gotten a cat a much. I mean, I did unlock. Uh, I was. I, I didn't say I unlock, but. Someone helped me get to floor three and beat the professor so I could unlock the solos. So I've been trying to go into Bonzo solo, and it's a little harder than I intended, but I did manage to get a full set of adaptive armor, so I got that situated for my next run, so I appreciate that. I'll probably end up doing that, uh, probably doing Kata stuff tomorrow or the day after, just because today I've... I had to do a little bit of errands this morning. I had to go to, uh, had to go get some, uh, some church. I had to go to church, get some food and everything. And this is more like a chill kind of day. <laughs> but yo, I'm always down for free cattle runs. I'm for, once I get geared, I'm gonna be offering cattle runs, like to help out anyone who it might be new to high pixel or anything like that. So I used to play on high pixel. Before I, I was gonna go, I was gonna return, but my account got hacked by a, by an MC store account from one of the other many, many multiplayer servers I played on. They hacked my main account, and I, unfortunately, Microsoft closed that account indefinitely. Which is why I am, uh, not as far as I want to be right now. <laughs> Because I had a I had a couple million uh, in the bank. I had some pretty good stuff before I, I walked away. So if you look back on some old streams about nine about nine ten months ago, I did a hundred and twenty million giveaway, and I just gave away a whole bunch of like different like clay minions, snow minions, all that stuff. So. But that's also when I had a lot of Contra. I have zero Contra on this profile. None. So, I'm very proud to say that. That everything I ha I've done so far has been no Contra. So. Nothing's been given. It's all been earned. Which, unfortunately, does keep things slow. <laughs> it does keep progression slow, but... Counter runs... I don't, I don't consider cattle runs Contra, because I always try to get, like, you know, the thir at least a third milestone. So, what are we doing right now is stuck sky block. Well, that's a good question. What do we got going on right now? We got Spooky Festival in 15 hours. Traveling Zoo in an hour, in a day in two hours. Okay, I could probably do that. Season of Jerry. Season of Jerry is where I made all my money. I got a golden gift the first season of Jerry I came up with on this uh profile that gave me about six million because i sold the gold the golden gift 
So we got that to look forward to. And we got the new year going. I should probably work on Revenant Slayer. Hmm. So I want a better wand of healing. So I think that's what we'll do a couple of rev uh, red boss kills. And then uh, go from there. Uh, take 60,000 out. Oh, we got 3.8 million. Kind of trying to run low in the purse. Yeah, but we need to upgrade our, our uh, zombies. I can probably do Revenant Horror 3 now. We'll, we'll stay 2. We'll stay 2. I'm not going to push it. Yeah. I'll tell you what, there's a huge difference from when the last time I played like, from 10 months 10 months ago until now. Cuz like I went to go buy wise dragon armor. I'm like, "Ah, oh, I'll, I'll go get some wise dragon." And I seen how expensive it got. I was like, "Dude, are you serious?" <laughs> So like I thought about getting young armor, but I saw that I saw that unstable could be really good. So I went ahead and Went for unstable dragon armor. I'm kind of happy I did. Unstable dragon's been kind of fun. Because, I mean, look at that. Uh. Hello. Day to day, I don't know where they get. Just casually walking past zombies and killing them. Because I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I, I honestly don't. I came back and I just got whatever was cheap and I did whatever I could as far as what I remember. So, IGN is Ciroc13 with the capital S. Then the blaze rod you're using, it's called the Aurora, uh, Heroic Aurora Staff. It's the first thing I bought whenever I got some serious money. Because it does wonders. Like you can see, it, it's pretty sick. Drop stuff, yeah. I hate that the boss drops don't go directly to your inventory. They really should. But yeah, it's an Aurora staff. It's my name with the number 13 behind it. So, like that. That's my IGN. It used to be just a rock, but that account got banned because of the whole hacking situation. Which I would love to find out. Um, I love to find out the owner of that M that MC Store account and really give them a nice talking. 
Mars likes him that can grind again. Oh, you dropped something. Foul flesh. Increase the speed of your mini by 90% for five hours. Ooh. That sounds cute. Me likey. Me likey lots. I could definitely go for uh, a minion speed up. By 90% for five hours. That's crazy. I could throw that on my emerald minion, bro. Try to get the personal bank a lot quicker. All right. And we need 20 more. Let's do one more. That'll get us level three. I'm trying to unlock the healing ones. And then I also want to work on the campfire badge too. Try to get that a little bit higher if possible. This is probably the easiest time I've had down here, though. I can try for the next level for the 400k, but the 400k is gonna be rough because I'm not doing that kind of damage. It's gonna take a couple hits, and he has life steal. So I don't think level three is a smart play for me right now. What the bloody hell? What is that skin, and why is it weird? All right, Ribbon of Viscera. All right, and we got the Wand of Mending unlocked. And let's see, that's going to be my current wand, Enchanted Dark Oak, Wood, and Revenant Viscera. Okay. Darn it. And that's two stacks plus Enchanted String. Yikes. Uh, yeah, just do it. How hard is Sven 2? Uh, I can't do that much harder, right? Yeah, let's just go for it. We'll just go for it. What's the worst gonna happen? I, I fail and lose 18k? Nothing. What's up, funny bones? Underground. Um, no, <laughs> no. Seven two is easy. Okay. As you can see, I haven't done very much wolf, so.
you, okay, buddy? I'll eventually hit you. Or you'll hit me. Or you'll hit me. Can I not? Okay, I can. Oh, I have to slice him. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, he's not affected by magic. Well, I didn't expect that. What an unhappy turn of events. My god, the lag. rough without a freaking weapon. <laughs> Got him. Oh. Screw that. <laughs> he doesn't take magic damage. So, I mean... Undead Callus drops rarely from Revenant Horrors when he's... When you're at least... Oh, okay, cool. Crystallized Heart, Undead Sword, Revenant Falchion. Nice, that's pretty cool. Golden Tooth. Okay. He doesn't take magic damage! He, he, he kind of forgot that part. My, my sword's not that great. I, I, you know what I should do? I should probably work on accessories, huh? Eh, no. I should work on rare accessories. That's what I should technically do. Alright. Radiant Power Orb Recipe. Goal 2. 43. Nice. Place over 30 seconds buffing up to 5 players within 15 blocks. Heals 1% of max health per second. Oh. Oh, it's a deployable. Okay. Well, that's cute. Cool. You guys fit. Oh my god. Alright. We're looking at 1k for that. What kind? Oh. That's a huge damn jump right there. That's a huge damn jump. What else, spiders? Technically not impossible. But can I hit it with magic? Let's find out. Let's go do spiders one, and we'll see if we can attack with magic. If it doesn't take magic, I'm gonna have to start switching up to a different build. <laughs> I feel like most of the good builds are reserved for like late game. So. I'm gonna assume so, because I was able to beat it before. But like Arachne doesn't.
Okay, so yeah, that does. Very easily. Okay. What was the what was the item that you can get? I think it's uh we can get the wolf four, you get the Maddox phone. That way you don't have to keep going back like this and you can just keep farming it. Why play this garbage? Because I am having fun playing the garbage, so that's why. They call me, they call me the garbage man. <laughs> Alright, 600 worth of spiders. And then, yeah. And then we've got tarantula web. Seven hundred and seventy seven bits. Yeah, so do I. I know from experience as well. I used to play this quite frequently back in the day. Right, I'll, I'll join your party, but Oh you really? Right. Ooh. I'm surprised there's so many people doing arachne. Doing uh, Spider Two. during the Halloween event. Oh my goodness, I hate responding. Uh, yeah, I forgot about party chat. My bad. I can't spell. That's why, like, I was kind of in the middle of fighting that thing, so. T3 repress. Okay. Uh. I don't know. I don't know. That doesn't really put me that much further, even with the experience. Because T3 and T4 rev. I don't know. Well, let me look at Maddox first. T3 gives me a hundred. Yeah, and T4 would probably give 400, I'm assuming. And that's if you can finish that. So yeah, that wouldn't do too much. That spider was a pain in the ass. Was that not a two? Yeah, that was a two. Oh, I have to click to challenge him. Yikes. Um. Fuck it. Sure. Yeah. All right. Go kill some zombies. I have lots of intelligence. Yeah, that's why I was trying to work on uh, redstone minions so I get more. What's my reforge? Necrotic and wise.
See, I was thinking about getting shadow goggles. I just wasn't sure about it. Trading. Huh? Probably dark goggles. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, oh, that works. <laughs> I have some at the. I have some of my island. I can grab. Yeah. Uh, let me go. Hang on. Yeah, I canceled because I got a little worried because uh, homeboy there. Oh, I don't have necrotic wise. Uh, I can grab the shadow goggles. That's fine. Uh, no, 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 no. I got it. Oh uh, no. Yeah, because I don't want. Remember, I don't want to take any contra or anything. So I'll just go buy uh, the shadow goggles real quick. It's gonna be a problem. That's good, I just need a second. Oh, I need the dark. Okay. Uh, whatever. Alright. Are there shadow goggles? I don't have a necrotic thing. I'll let you know to see how much it is and, uh. In here. The reforge. Power stones, reforge. Necromancer's brooch. Oh, not bad, actually. <laughs> Combined with armor. Okay. <laughs> so I'll switch that out. Oh, I know. I gotta go right here. Here we go. Necrotic shadow goggles. Go necrotic unstable. There we go. There we go. Hi. Hello. Huh. I have shadow goggles now. Yep. <laughs> I believe so. There's no, uh, no issues. So. Don't see any problems with it. I'll drop that in there for now. I'll go talk to Maddox real quick. Go turn this in. I didn't know I could make bits by doing this. Yeah. I'm not worried about make. I'm not worried about using money. I'll make more. Like it's nothing. It's 
player recipes, RNG meter. Uh, I'll live and learn. <laughs> oh, I did with. Do you wanna do Rev four or three? Either way, I'm gonna need money, so I should probably go grab money. So I just put it all away. I have a, I have a bad habit of just like depositing all and being done. Uh, healing's gonna be hard for me. Uh, I'm gonna grab 100k. Alrighty. Pew, 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 pew. All right. You said try four, so we'll try it four. <laughs> nope. Yeah, like. I knew I was subbing like, yo, I appreciate that. You're more than welcome. Sorry, I'm trying to type the guy in, uh, in party chat at the same time. I'm horrible with, like, doing multiple... Oh, hi. With doing multiple, uh, conversations at once. k nice hi deformed revenant how you doing oh fuck Special drop or no? No, it's just more. I'm trying to keep going. So, when's my next life? Probably tomorrow sometime. I don't have a. Uh... I don't have uh, a schedule. I just try to stream once a day. It's usually between like 7 a.m. Eastern Standard to like 2 2 p.m. I'll just go live and I'll just go live forever long. I feel because. Just one of them things. RNG meter has sword experience. Nice. Alright, so Sven. <laughs> Alright. Do you know what's next vid? I don't do videos anymore. I mainly just do stream. Wow, he's fast. I mainly just do streaming. Yeah, my next live will be tomorrow. I 
I've been going live once every day for the last, like, I would say a week or two. And then uh, I'll go live like twice a day on some days. But that usually involves me playing World of Warcraft for the second stream. Oh, what the fuck? That's a weird doggo. I did not expect a special doggo to come out of here. Oh. Damn. They show me their teeth. Okay, but what's the content tomorrow? Probably gonna be more Minecraft. I've been playing, I usually play Minecraft, Final Fantasy XIV, or World of Warcraft. But I've been doing a lot of Minecraft recently. If I had to pick what I was, as far as like, what kind of streamer, I'm a gaming streamer. Focus on variety. Oh, hi. Oh, boy! <laughs> Oh boy, huh? Oh, I love it when I'm lied to. <laughs> Was ever high pixel? Uh, yeah, I only play on high pixel right now, as far as multiplayer servers. And I uh. Sorry, I got distracted. Um. Yeah, and then I only play uh my hardcore world. Uh, how to tell? While he's here, I'm going to have him help with that three. Yeah. I got water log. Hi. That's right, these guys drop tea. I almost lost that tea. Whew. These are rough. No pun intended. Excuse you? Oh fuck. Nice. Alright. Let's go run, get this situated then.
Uh, a Sven too will get us what we need. What's, your goal? What's my goal by the end of the week? Uh, to keep breathing and keep streaming. <laughs> I don't stream for any goals. I just stream to hang out and chill. So I don't have like a, a like goal, a sub goal, or anything like that. I just I'm just here to hang out. That gives us the fat, the bat phone next. Fire! What's up, my dude? Yeah, I used to worry about sub goals and light goals and all that stuff. And then I found out that it just stresses the person out, whoever's streaming, and it just makes a whole bunch of nonsense. So it, it's a lot of pressure to put on someone. So it's like having a sales, like being in sales, and uh. You have to you have to sell so much by the end of the week. I mean, yeah, it, it's a lot of stuff. There's no point having that kind of stress. Hi. So I just hmm. So I, I just chill. Faking, like, don't get me wrong, there's people who, who do things their own way, and that's totally fine. I'm not going to say that the way one streamer plays or does things is wrong. But, I feel like a lot of, uh -oh. a lot of it's not genuine, so. That's what a lot of streaming is missing, is the, the, the genuine, like, personality of people. Hey, here we go. Ah. <laughs> and here the whole duck in time. Oh shoot! <laughs> Fire, you got me distracted. How dare you? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Hi. Got a fairy soul. Nice. Nice. Don't say anything because I'm doing intense shit at work. No, that's fine. You can swear. It's just you lose your ability to make any ad rev if you swear too too soon, like in videos or anything. But I don't have to worry about that because I'm not. Uh, I I have no way of making money off my YouTube content anyways. So. Dude, that is so cool. That is so cool. <laughs> oh, that's so awesome. And no, I'm not, I don't really care about money or anything. Four uh, fifty thousand coins. Yikes. Uh, ah. and then withdraw. Eh, that'll Yeah, I'm still relearning Skyblock stuff, so... <laughs> it's fine, if I get kicked from YouTube, I get kicked from YouTube, then I just go to Twitch. That or I just post private stuff in my, uh... In my, uh, Discord. Doesn't matter.
Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna wait on uh, that kind of stuff for the time being. Uh, recipe book, special recipes? No. Slayer recipes. So, Wand of Mending. Can I go into a collections and see it? Uh, no. You have a Discord server? Yes, I do. Alright, Flip. What's the name? Uh, it's technically called Sorok Sanctum, I think. But, uh, there should be... Huh. There should be a Discord link in the description of the stream. Let me double check. I don't know, YouTube's been doing all kinds of fun stuff with me. I don't know, YouTube's so. been doing all kinds of fun stuff with... Excuse me, that's me talking, not you. Yeah. Under join the family, there's Discord and there's Twitter. So it should work. Okay. I love the Aurora stuff, I just don't like the damn kill go down. Give more of the drops. My health got low on that one. Leggings, rev boots, travel scroll, hub grips. Oh, I get rev minion here soon? Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, Fi gives me the rev minion, which would be really cool. Okay, what's rev legs look like? Enchanted diamonds. Trolling the Reaper. Killing one heals 50%. Gain a 100 against zombies. Kill zombies that accumulate defense against them. Dang. Okay, that's kind of good. It's a three-piece, too. Huh. So, probably... I've had a really long morning, so I wasn't even planning on doing this, but I mean, I can't say no to this. This is just too good. Oh, Minecraft, Minecraft. There we go. Oh, 
yeah, sometimes fire clips some really funny things that happens to me. And then it really drives me nuts. Fire. I have a love-hate relationship with my mods. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, fire. Before I forget. Um, hang on, let me. Okay. Uh. I didn't add him as a friend, but okay. So, fire, let me show you something real quick. Zombie, eat one. Uh, I'll, I'll wor I'm working on a zombie. One thing at a time. <laughs> so, fire, guess what? We, uh... We found the end structure. We have the end portal for the dragon fight. It's just waiting. So, it's going to be really nice. I've, I got a mending trader, so that's I have that going on. Right now, I'm trying to get uh, enchanting levels so I can increase uh, the bow power to three. And then maybe we can find a, like, a power three or power five. Yeah, I, I'm pretty much in standby mode right now. I'm trying to increase my armor up and everything. I don't have like a bunch of prop for like prot 2 and all that. I really need to work on this, so. And as you've seen down here, I, I did it again. Actually, down here, I got the nether wart here. I got a whole bunch of stuff. I got some strength potions, some fire res potions, a water breathing potion. So, I have potions brewed. I just gotta work on a chance, and then it's go mode. And then we will officially, hopefully, if everything goes well, we might actually, for the first time ever, beat the Ender Dragon on Hardcore. So I'm, I'm, I'm hoping. I'm, I'm hoping. I got screenshots of the coordinates of where uh, the Ender... Dude, okay, so... The end structure... The beginning of the str you'll look in the beginning of the stream. The end structure was inside of a giant, hollowed out, lush cavern. And it was underneath it, and it was like, it was mixed in with the lush cavern and with part of a, of skulk area. So it was like half skulk, half ender structure. It was so wicked looking, like it, it was nice. So, <laughs> oh, good times, it was good times. But yeah, like so off stream, uh, I'm probably gonna end up working on uh, getting some more enchant levels, get some of this gear situated so that the next time we uh, stream from the hardcore, sir, the hardcore uh, mode here, we'll be ready to go for the Ender Dragon. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm feeling pretty good about it myself, honestly. I'm feeling pretty good about it. So. I mean, we'll see. The worst thing that could happen is the Enderman. But I'll have a water bucket, so I'll have a way to counter the Enderman in case that becomes a problem. And then, that's why I'm also getting a bow, so I can shoot the dragon while he's in the air. I'm probably not going to go melee too heavy. Oh, you know, you, you know what you could do? It's a little cheatsy. I could bring a couple of boats. And I don't think the Ender Dragon can knock you up if you're in a boat. I mean, we could definitely test that theory out during the fight. <laughs> I'm not going to pre-test anything. I'm not going to, like, do any practice runs. I'm going in as plain as day and just... You'll be with me. We'll be hoping for the best. 
Nope, we're not testing it. We're not testing it beforehand. Because I'll have... I'll have ender pearls as a backup. And then I'll also have water bucket for bucket clutches. So we'll be fine. I got feather falling right here to help out. I got some mending books to keep our gear uh, definitely safe. I'm feeling very good about this fire. Feeling very, very good about this. But yeah. Whew. I need to see. It's got three days left, or I can skip it with gems. I can't do that with gems. I really don't care about island size. Oh, this only has an hour left, so then I'll have a next ender chest page. Um, accessory bags are where I should probably go next. Yeah. Magic find doesn't really help me too much early game. It's more like a late game kind of thing, I would think. Accessory bags can give me more intellect. So, yeah, I think accessory bags are where I go. Hi, friend! What's up? Well, hello there. Okay. But, yeah. I'll wait for two hours, I'll get this going, and then I'll, I'll probably end up going accessory back for four days. Uh, Ender chest is definitely helpful, but now that I've actually cleaned everything out, you know, we got everything going. There's a flower minion? Hold the fu- Oh, you know what? Thank you, guy. Thank you, random guy in the lobby. That just reminded me. Withdrawal. So 1.565. Let's go by green thumb, dandelion. <laughs> Buy it out. Craft it. Go to bazaar and sell it. This is one of the easy flips that everyone knows about. Uh, Chain of Deadline's 108k. So yeah, I just made 100,000 just off that. I didn't swear. At least if I did, then I don't remember it, so. And I was actually making a real effort to not swear, so you should be very proud of me. I was making an effort. Well, you might be cooked. Because I was actually, for once in, in a long time, I was, I was putting the... I was putting the filter on just for you and your little and your little brother there. So I'm gonna make sure I didn't disrespect anyone. For that little gap of time. Alright. Alright, so we were looking at what? He said the zombie sword. Okay, so zombie soldier cutlass. So there's that one. Cata skill 19. Yikes, that's crazy. Heal for 120 plus 5 percent and heal players and. Oh, that's the actual zombie story you're talking about. 
There's a whip. Oh. Uh, oh, uh, well. I do, I do apologize for that, then. Floored zombie. Okay, so that's... Five charges, 15 seconds. I guess that makes sense. 1.3 mil is quite a, quite a big ask. It's quite a big ask. I mean, why not? I feel like that's really cheap. Looks like that's about on, on par. That's six mil for that one. Four mil for that one. Oh, that is ultimate wise on if it's 2.9 mil. Okay, so yeah, it gets a little crazy. So, oh, you know, that's fine. I need to dungeonize it, which is going to be a thing. But I think uh, that's weird. I think we're fine. Uh, essence crafting. Convert to dungeon. Catacombs 18 to convert this item. Okay. Can I upgrade it though? 30 undead essence. Okay. What does that do for me? Just stat base stats? Yeah, base stats. That doesn't really help anything outside base stats. Um. <laughs> Got 34 wither and. Okay. That's a lot of essences. I guess they're catering to the people who've been here a while. Sharp, epic, fast, fair. Ah, yikes. Spicy, no. Legendary is 25. Gentle, no. Spicy, gentle. Epic, no. Heroic, ah, that's what I'm looking for. Looking for heroic. Uh, I'm horrible at PvP. You will honestly whoop my butt. It is not a, even a contest. You will win. I suck at it. So, yeah. I, I would not even be a threat at all. I promise you. Alright. That's 200k there. We got 800 bits. I could probably see if I can make some money off of those. Okay, so not buying a god pot. I know cat flowers aren't selling that well. The kismet feather, I, could... I know people would buy that really quickly. I could buy a cat flower. 
Yeah, we'll buy a cat flower and we'll sell it real quick. I'm not going to make much money on the cat flower, unfortunately, because it doesn't sell that well, but we'll see. Okay, so lowest price is five ninety. So we'll throw it up there for five eighty. Oh. Five eighty eight. And I put all my money in the darn bank. Goodness gracious. Huh. Right, welcome back. Yeah, I gotta do some mining and stuff off, off stream here. Try to get some more money stacked. Uh, create auction. All right, there we go. There we go. All right, we'll eventually get that, get that money from there. That'll be a half a mil. Ugh. I'm trying to think what I should pop. I'll flesh on. 90% for 5 hours. It's tempting. It's tempting in many on many of these guys, honestly. Honestly, you know what? Let's do it. Put it on the redstone minion. Try to get my accessory bags unlocked quicker. Even by, if even if by a little. Even if by a little. Alrighty. I think that being said, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. I appreciate you guys for being here and whatnot. Uh, recipe book. Oh, nice. Flower sold. We have the Wand of Mending. Which we need Rev Visera, which is... Oh, okay, we could do that. Uh... Well, oh, no, maybe not. Chanty string. Alright. It's alright, fire. We're good. Here we go. Anyways, catch y'all later, and I'll see you, let me think. It'll definitely be tomorrow. I'll have to see what we do for tomorrow, though, if I want to do Hypixel or what. It's going to be how I feel. Who knows, maybe tomorrow's Ender Dragon Day, if I can get enough of uh, enough stuff situated for my enchants on my, on my uh, hardcore world. That might be fun. I don't have a, a set time. It's just have alert, have your, uh, have notifications on. And, yeah. I usually go live, and I'm usually live for about anywhere between an hour and, and four hours. It's very fluid. I'm very hit and miss, I'm sorry to say. I, I just show up. I'm like the doctor. No, Fire, I'm never late. Only you are. <laughs> but. I appreciate you. I can't talk now. Can I play Survival? Uh, I'm playing Hardcore. Does that not count? <laughs> My skills are not great. I can't build for anything, and I can't survive for anything. So, I'm just going to let you know. I'm not great. I am super casual. I'm not like a sweaty MC player. Yeah, I play default Minecraft. That's what hardcore. That's what the hardcore world is. So I've been playing hardcore on and off today already. Anyways, I'll catch y'all next time. Take it easy.